All right, let's rock. You can hop in if you want. Usually make coffee right when I wake up. That way I got it for the ride. And by the uh, time I get in to the facility, I'm all coffeeed up and ready to roll. Coffee and, uh, and warming up in the hot tub, first thing. Those are pretty, uh, pretty important daily rituals. Between making a, you know, a phone call, uh, listening to Radio Margaritaville, or uh, listening to a podcast, that's, uh, those are pretty much the go-to's right there. This is, this is easy because it's about the 20th time I've made this drive from the hotel to the, to the uh, training facility. Usually thinking about uh, the day, uh, thinking about uh, you know the practice, the opponent, and that kind of thing. Just start to start to lock in on what you need to do that day to, to prepare for that week. And then uh, then the, the way home is a little different. That's a little more decompressing. Having a three-year-old and a one-year-old, you know, they're running around the house without a care in the world, and you know, I know that football is probably the furthest thing, uh, you know, in their mind. So, uh, you know, just being around that kind of helps, you know. And I'm I'm lucky to you know, have a have a nice uh, loving family that kind of will take my you know mind off uh, football uh, at times and, and allow for some decompression that way. It's really every day is important because you're getting evaluated in practice, you're getting evaluated in the games. The games are you know, nice because it you know, it's a chance to go you know, and actually play somebody uh, you know, outside your own teammates. Cuts are live and you, know, you can take out a little more aggression and you know, really work on you know, finishing guys to the ground and whatnot. I feel like you need like a little app for this so we can get a rating of your like, Lyft or Uber. Gotcha. 66, all right, thanks. Yep. Hey Broncos country, thanks for carpooling with me to work. I'll see you at training camp.